This video explains how to include websites in your reference list according to APA Style 6th edition. If your instructor has told you to only use scholarly or peer-reviewed sources, this does not include websites. Instead, visit the Munn Library's webpage to search for books, ebooks, and scholarly journal articles. Sometimes it may be appropriate to use a website for a course or an assignment, but you have to evaluate websites very carefully. There are some credible, good sources of reliable information out there, like government or museum websites. But unfortunately, plenty more are not credible, very well written, and would not be good sources for a university paper. For help with evaluating websites, check out Munn Library's webpage, How to Evaluate Internet Resources. In this example, punctuation is in red for emphasis. In your actual reference list, all font would be in black. Include as much of the following information as possible. Start with the author's last name, followed by their initials. In parentheses, put the date of creation or publication, if it's available. Then the title of the web page or document. In APA style, the first letter of every word of a web page's title is not capitalized. Just the first letter of the first word, the first word of the subtitle, and proper nouns. Then write retrieved from and copy and paste the direct URL link to the web page or document. If all of the information is available on the web page, your citation will look like this. Notice that the URL isn't hyperlinked or underlined. It's the same font as the rest of the reference with no period after it. However, it's often difficult to locate all the necessary information for websites. Often no specific author is given, or it's difficult to determine a publication date. If there is no author given, start with the title of the web page or web document instead, followed by a period, then the date in parentheses. If there is no date indicated, use the abbreviation n.d. to indicate no date. For more information about APA style, check out some of our other videos or visit the Munn Library's webpage for our online APA style guide and to chat live with library staff.